Okay, as I said before, when you select a pattern like this in the settings, we have a lot of properties that I want to explain the elastic in this time. You can select the whole pattern for uh, compressing or expanding the lines. It's very easy, I will explain it. For example, we have an, uh, a simple pattern here that we have a lot of pin there. You can go to pin and for deleting the pin, you can uh, hold in control and the, then W. Control W for disabling the pins. And right click simulation, oops, simulation properties and make it a zero to when you simulate, we in have no gravity. And when you select a pattern, as you can see, the elastic works with the lines, the segments. If you select the pattern, it means you select all of its segments. And here you can activate the elastic. When you activate elastic, as you can see, we have two simple settings. Strength, it's control the power of the elastic. Don't change it. The important thing is the ratio. If you simulate, as you can see, it's compressing the lines. <laughs> it is elastic. When you, the simulation is on, as you can see, all of these segments are compressing because of the elastic mode. If you go a higher number, as you can see, it's, it's trying to expand the line. As you can see, we have more line here. For better seeing that, you can, for example, if you want to mm, tighten this line, you can use this elastic for just this segment. You can go to the edit segment, select holding shift. And as you can see, when you select the segment, we have also elastic enable it. And as you can see, it's compressing that line and you can create elastic mode here. So it's very easy. <clears throat> so, or you can create an elastic somewhere in the internal line. You can create an internal line, for example, here with double click and it, and we have an internal line here. As you can see, we have it. We select that line, go to the edit pattern, then select this. And as you can see, you have to find the elastic here. You can turn it on. And now we tighten in this part that is elastic. You can go a smaller number. As you can see, we have more elastic mode or a higher number you can expand that line. Interesting. And here tell you this is a segment line and this is a total length because of the elastic. Nice. So when you select a pattern, it means all of the line in it, you can expand or compress it with elastic mode, or you can select the internal line or select a specific line. And as you can see, the line the or segment that you change its elastic mode, they have changed to the light green. In a Marvel Designer or Clue 3D, you have to understand the colors. It means, okay, in these lines, you have changed some, you have changing some properties. In this mode, this color means you change the elastic mode of that. Nice. Hello, my friends. To continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.